Hello everybody, I'm supposed to be a blessing. This is my reading for my Sagittarius. If you're new to my channel, please take a moment to like, subscribe, and comment. Alright, Sagittarius, so first and foremost, you have the Ace of Swords. Ace of Swords talks about you receiving clarity in regard to some things that are taking place within your life. I do feel this though there's doors and window opportunities going to open up with you because you planted some seeds that's definitely going to grow. You've been working extremely hard with the Three of Wills right here, and I feel that the universe is blessing you. Mm-hmm. All right. Yeah, you're hunting and you're crafting your skill with the Eight of Wheels right here. And you're definitely manifesting with this Magician card. Go ahead on. Get it, y'all. The Fool card tells me that you want a new beginning. You're going to jump out and do something new and exciting. Mm -hmm. You're going to take a risk and it's definitely going to work out for you in your favor. I do feel this though emotional feeling and happiness is coming towards you. It's definitely you standing in your own energy. Or there could be another Leo, Sagittarius that's coming towards you to make an offer. Alright. Some of you definitely been defending yourself against others. That's all the time because people stay jealous. Hey, it is what it is. There's been some harsh words that have been spoken to you with the Eight of Swords. Somebody do it. Some fuck file shit here, but it's all gonna come to an ending. Could be dealing with the Sagittarius, but I do see your life is transforming, Sagittarius. Hmm. Another two of wands. So this is telling me that you definitely I'm gonna be making um you at a crossroads in life. You're trying to decide what to do. What are you gonna do with somebody? I said it's somebody or something, but it's definitely people. Hmm. With the Empress, you're birthing out new exciting things, and you got a lot of things on your mind. Shit, that's a ten of swords. I normally call this card somebody that took somebody ass to heal them back. But that's also an ending. With endings, I was coming to begin. It's a lot of stuff on your mind. Could something could have caused you a lot of heartache and pain and disappointment, or you could have caused somebody that in their lives. Mm -hmm. But this is you, Temperance. Hello, you needed some balance within your life, and I feel like. Some of you are feeling very trapped. You don't know what to do. You have some type of wishes that you want fulfilled. It's definitely going to come far for you. You have the Six of Wands. It's telling me you're going to be very victorious. But you have to be careful. The next card is the Moon card. There's some lies, deception, and deceit surrounding you. When you're lying to somebody, somebody is definitely lying to you. Remember, whatever is going to dark will definitely come to the light. There's also a Tower moment that's going to come to. I see that the tower moment is just a learning lesson. Mm -hmm. May not be what you like, but at this time, you have to go through it. All right? Look at this card that's coming out next. It's the hermit card. The hermit card is facing this tower moment as well as the moon. So, you could be isolating yourself to try to figure something out in regard to some fuck fire shit or whatever is going on. Whatever the last reception in the seat, you're very intuitive. You don't figure it out. It could have took you throwed you off your game for just a minute but it is what it is you're gonna figure that out you're gonna work it out you need to make that head of a hard decision here this two of swords it's a very creative time for you with the ace of wands hello celebrations is definitely arriving with the three of cups hmm your ships is coming on the horizon something you've been waiting for is definitely coming in i do see here the seven of cups there's something that you're thinking about, you're hoping and wishing for it here. Seven Cups can be plenty of offers that's definitely coming your way. And it's going to make you extremely happy with the Sun card. Could be a Leo that could be interesting to you as well. You have the Two of Cups. So that's a partnership card all day, every day. You have the Strength card that could be telling you to stand in your strength, guard to some things that are taking place. And the Star card says you're shining extremely bright. So, and things will balance out for you. I'm going to make that wish. Yeah. What is this? Hmm. So you're definitely weighing your options in regard to someone or something. I see you receiving a message. There's a message. Look, an offer coming in from a water sign. And it's saying that by this being a water sign, somebody's going to be speaking a message to you um, from their feelings. Because, you know, water is feelings. How you feel about a situation. Or somebody feeling some type of way in regard to you. And they're going to send you a message. Um. <clears throat> dead. All right, financial increases on the horizon. Your world is definitely changing, but it's going to change for the better. I see somebody reminiscing about the past with the Six of Cups. Either it's you or somebody you're dealing with. But, you know, all in all, there's new love coming in. All right, are you ready? <laughs> all right, um, Sagittarius, I hope you enjoyed this reading. Please like, subscribe, and comment to my channel. I have a truly, truly blessed day. Thank you.